Uh huh. Nice. Little grappling hook trick. Always good. Let's pull this down from here to see what's in the vents. <laughs> At least it's not giving us these annoying robots anymore. So, pull this one up. It's like, we know you can deal with the security systems at this point. We trust you. Come on, grab the thing. There we go. I'm running on such little health right now. Oh, I can't get through here. Okay. <laughs> I was wondering what on earth was going on there for a second. All right. Let's grab this and keep moving. Stepping on through. Aha, that's the one we need to go down. Yep. And this needs somebody standing on it. Uh-oh. There's bombs. <laughs> yeah, we definitely needed to dodge those, didn't we? Ah, that's not good. <laughs> we got bombed. We absolutely got bombed. Okay, well, uh, hopefully that's restored some of my health. <laughs> yeah, I'll take it. Now, exercise extreme caution. <laughs> there we go. They're certainly bombing a lot of stuff. Oh, okay, we can just bash our way through those. All right. <laughs> I don't mind that. Don't mind that at all. Oh, gosh, we're into the tubes now. And But how are we meant to get through here? Because we couldn't get through there before from the other side. What on earth? Are we meant to grab one of these? <laughs> I guess not, but how on earth do we go through here? Oh, hello. There's a button here we can press. What does that do? I am worried. I am very, very worried. Ow. <laughs> yeah. That's what I was worried about. Oh, ho, ho, that was so close. Yeah, this ain't good. Ouch. Huh. Oh, Master Otis, are you alright? Here, let me assist you. Yeah, I could use a bit of food, Alphonse, if you got any. Alphonse! Where are we? It seems we have locked ourselves in the ship's armory. They have enough firepower here to wipe out any remaining settlements with ease. And even without this arsenal, Molstrom would still be unstoppable using nothing but the relics. The only real chance we have is to acquire those relics and use them against him. Then we better move fast. I think the ship is headed towards Veli. This ship is unknown to me, but I'm certain we could use some of this firepower to get out of here. Well, yeah, those giant crates with the skulls on them, in particular, I'm, I'm quite quite keen on the idea of those. So, uh, fancy helping me out here, buddy? Hocha! And boom. Oh, I guess we light the fuse? I guess we light the fuse then. And that was pretty useless, considering that <laughs> it should have been slightly closer to the door. Yeah, I would not use a shotgun anywhere near those things, but, you know, whatever. Let's drop this one over here by the door. Yeah, I would not throw them around either, but... <laughs> Apparently these guys are freaking fearless at this point, so who am I to argue, right? 
Alright, we need to grab this. And then use Twig to pull that through the door, I guess. Nice. Easy enough, I suppose. For now, at least. Yeah, I'm still not happy with him using a shotgun to blow these things up. I'm really not. I got problems with that. Now, if we... Yeah, okay, we can drop it on there and then take down layers of it like so. Shaboom. I'll have another one of those if you don't mind. I saw at least one switch that Alphonse was definitely necessary to open, which was in here. I think if we go back through this little passage and then we head down... Ah, oh, no! <laughs> that was a close one. They are certainly bombing a lot of stuff right now, aren't they? I guess we needed these hooks to get back the whole time. Pretty clever. And now, if Alphonse stands on this, then the switch opens that. Fantastic. Okay, great. So now we can get through here somehow, but we can't open the door from this side. So that's a concern. How do we get out? I guess we have to go up there using the uh, using the vents. Can we go back up this way? I guess we do. Oh, very clever. All right. And then we pop him on here like this. And then we get through here like that. Very cool. Very cool. Yeah, I had a feeling there was uh, an element of timing there that I wasn't quite grasping. All right. We're here. And goodness me, I need some food. I need to heal somehow. It was not easy getting in here. Right. I guess we're going in. Me and Twig. <laughs> Ah, yeah, this is going to be a problem. I have a feeling I'll need to die here in order to have a fair fight. <laughs> so, you made it all the way up here. Molstrom didn't even suspect you guys were coming. <laughs> of course I knew better. Please, please just let us through to Molstrom. There must be a way to stop this path of destruction that he has led us on. I have a little time before the captain figures out you're here. That means you'll let us go? <laughs> Unlikely. This guy's had it out for Alphonse for a while now. And Twig no better. Hardly. We could solve this so easily if you just let me and my friends part- FRIENDS?! <laughs> I like the way his knife just disappears. Why would you ever feel the need to seek such frailties? Pathetic. Powerless. Only weaklings who can't fend for themselves will seek friendship. Just look at them! Yeah, they were kind of cowering in fear for a second. We were on our way to become the strongest, yet you abandoned us. Yeah, he's not happy. And he's got two blades now. You're going to pay, Alphonse! You're all going to pay! And fight! Oh, it gave us full health back! Fantastic! Well... <laughs> I will deflect all of your stuff. Uh, I have no idea what to do with him right now, though. <laughs> You're mine! Uh-oh. Boom! Shotgun to the face. Grrrr! Oh, dear. Yeah, I forget these guys are robots. <laughs> so evidently he's malfunctioning just a little bit. Heh <laughs> 
Nice shot, Alphonse, but I'm only getting started. Grappling hook for the win. Oh, didn't mean to use Alphonse for that. Twig, get up here. Hey, knocked him into the ceiling. All right. And then I use my shotgun. Set him on fire. Yeah, that didn't work out. Oh, well. Did not mean to use my shotgun there. Ouch. Nice. And now shotgun. Boom in the face. Okay. <laughs> right. Ah. Yeah. Alphonse. Please stop this. If only we could shut up. You won't get away with your betrayal. I'll get you for what you've done. And more blades. I'll get you. Ah ha ha ha. No. No. Oh, this is tricky. <laughs> tricky. Help. Oh, my goodness. You need to do your charge up attack again, buddy. There we go. And get down. Shabam. In the face. And the music stops. So surely he is done. Oh, I hope so. Oh, this fight is taking his toll. It... It hurts. It hurts really bad. Alphonse, you abandoned us. You abandoned me. Oh. <laughs> and he shatters. Is that it? Is he done? He he he. Oh dear. I guess having a friend wasn't that bad after all. Huh. <laughs> and then he was gone. And then the entire game was gone. Why are we looking at a white screen here? Okay. <laughs> I guess he just kind of fizzled out of existence. Which I'm fine with. He's like... Oh, <laughs> Otis is looking a little bit shocked right now. Me too. Me too. Let's let's enter the only door we possibly can, and potentially go to meet our doom <laughs> against Molstrom. Flying away down the corridor. I really wish Geddy was here. Geddy is still in Veli. <laughs> I kind of feel like we should have gone back for him somehow. Right, we have three relics. One for each of us, I guess. So we have found them at last. The relics. So Doug did get the third one out of the floating con. I've no idea how either, because it was freaking covered in lava. We literally saw it engulfed in lava. How are we going to get them out? Let us try to break the relics out of these cages while we can. If we can make it out of the ship with just one relic. Uh, okay, but let's hurry. More pirates could show up any second now. Indeed, we'll need to be quick. Let's crack these cages open, Master Otis. Does not look like we can do a whole lot here, unfortunately. Looks like there's nothing we can do. Just had to flail against them ineffectually. These cages sure don't seem to break easily. Hmm. <laughs> Alphonse, do you know anything about these things? How can we break them? It is as I feared. The cages are too heavily reinforced. We all need to get the key from its custodian. And the only one who would have the keys to the relics would be Captain Molstrom himself. So, we kind of need to fight the most powerful dude in the ship. Unsurprising. Crud. So that's it? I mean, we can't defeat Molstrom. You guys saw him in Advent. I'm a great fighter, but even I'm not going up against Molstrom after that. Take heart, my friends. Yes, this is ill news, but in Advent, Molstrom had a relic. 
currently the relics are all here, so he should be considerably weaker compared to when we met him in Advent. The odds are still not in our favour, but if there was ever a time when we could defeat him, it would be now. Dot dot dot. Yeah, exactly. Alright. I'm in. We've gone up against terrible odds before. In fact, I prefer it this way. <laughs> now, from now, I'll be able to tell everyone that Twig, the world's greatest spider, defeated Captain Molstrom, the Scourge of the Skies. I believe Captain Molstrom's cabin lies at the end of this corridor. Yeah, right next to the freaking relics. Whatever happens, this will likely be the last time we fight together. Win or lose, our struggle ends here. You should both prepare yourselves for that. Is Getty not coming with us? Where's Getty? For goodness sake. I mean, he said that he could get in here easily, so uh, there is every chance that he's just going to pop up in a minute. But I feel like I should have gone back to Veli and at least tried to say hello, you know? Uh-oh. Yeah, this ain't good. <laughs> it's making me walk down this corridor. Dun dun dun. He's gonna like bust out of this door. Oh look at Otis. Otis is all like, I'm tiny and cold and an owl. Alright. Let's do this. Ha ha! Molstrom. It's it's really him. And he's saying nothing. Molstrom! What's this? Did the guards let you in? Prepare yourself! We've come to defeat you! You're here to fight me? That's right! <laughs> I don't even need to do the laugh, he's done it for me. Very well. Hopefully you can at least entertain me until the relics are finished charging. Then I will... Huh? What was that? I think it might be a surprise from outside. Oh! Have the relics finished charging? That's a worry. Oh, it's the owl. It's the mysterious hooded owl. <gasps> oh, it's him! It's that dude! <gasps> Amazing! What a twist! No going back after this. Oh, wow. Okay, he's got the relics. <laughs> yes! Good work, friend. Excellent work. Alright, let's do this. I fancy our chances now. Alarm! The relics have been stolen! Get him! Oh, and he's got his owl cloak. Amazing. Oh. Alert the captain! Tell him the owl boy has stolen the relics! That's the owl boy, of course. <laughs> Amazing. Repeat. The owl boy has stolen the relics! And you thought we were the Owlboy this whole time. What? That little pest double-crossed me. You. He sent you here to distract me. I'm going to destroy all three of you. Whoa, okay. Hey, it was Getty all along. I told you he was going to come along. Although, he, uh, <laughs> he had a, uh, <laughs> he had an interesting way of getting in here. All right, well. Looks like we are headed <laughs> for a confrontation with this guy the entire time. It was him. Dot, dot, dot. Wake up, Otis. I'm glad I caught him. That was a long fall. Stay safe, Otis. Don't follow me. <laughs> Heck yes, I'm following you. Master Otis, who goes there? Dun dun dun, and away he flaps. Away he flaps. Well, it was that guy the entire time. And he was the one telling us about the entrance to the Owl Temple and everything. He's got the relics now, too. I wonder what he's going to do with them. <laughs> Hopefully something more than what the pirates are going to do with them. Otis? Otis! You're awake! And we're back in Valley again. <laughs> this game keeps bringing us back to Valley. I'm sorry, Otis. I should never have left you guys alone. As soon as I got back to Valley, I knew I'd made a mistake. That twig guy, he was just being used by the pirates. I knew that, but I think I wanted someone to blame after Advent. I made my way up to the pirates and went looking for you straight away. Stole a pirate chopper and everything. 
I'm glad I made it in time. Malstrom seemed furious. But enough about this. Twig, Alphonse, Otis is awake. Get in here. <laughs> Welcome back, Otis. You've been asleep for so long now. I want to talk about what to do next, guys. Otis, Alphonse says he saw someone fly off with the relics. Indeed. And that someone went f uh, flying up past Mesos. We haven't figured out who took the relics yet, but... But whoever took them must have been behind all of this. The pirates were being fed information about the relics. Someone told them to search in Valley and in Advent. It would seem that whoever led them to attack these settlements have now finally gotten the relics they wanted. So the pirates were just being used? Serves them right! Indeed. But whoever did this must expect Molstrom to retaliate. They must be planning to use the relics soon. With the power of the relics, they might escape even Molstrom's wrath. Is there any way we can get to them before that happens? I don't know. It's impossible to fly past the Mesosphere. We would have to find some way to travel up there. With Advent destroyed, finding a ship won't be easy. Well, let's start looking. There's got to be some way. There's one more thing, Otis. Don't be too disappointed when we get to Valley. Things have changed a bit. How have things changed? Let's chat to everybody before we leave the house. I wonder what they might be planning to use the relics for. Is it only for power, or do the relics serve some other purpose? Twig is not one for chatting? Oh, maybe he is. I like this place. It's like our secret hideout. You live here? It's great. When all this is over, we should eat a big dinner here. Just thinking about it makes me hungry. Kind of makes me hungry too, actually. I should probably get something to eat in a minute. Me and Twig? Uh, yeah, we're good now. We talked it out while you were sleeping. Twig's just a big idiot. <laughs> All right, let's, uh, let's head outside and see what has changed about Valley. Maybe they've fortified against the pirates. Uh, looks pretty much the same as it was. Maybe there's a, a couple more spots in the graveyard. Oh, food. Food, food, food. I will absolutely have some food. <laughs> Still got the same amount of health I had when I left the ship. I will eat all of the sock fruits. All of the weird strawberries with hooks on the end. Nom, 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 nom. Well, it looks like we're probably going to leave it there, folks, for the moment at least. Thank you guys so much for watching Owlboy. Leave a like on the series if you're enjoying it. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more. Owlboy will be back, and I have a feeling there is still a little way to go before we complete this particular adventure. I'll see you guys soon. Bye for now.